Hi guys, welcome back. Hope you all are healthy and happy. So today I'll show you guys my 5 a.m. productive morning routine when I'm home. Well, I was never a morning person until I joined yoga sessions about few months back. Waking up after a good 7 hours of sleep. It's still cold during the mornings here. These days, I'm concerned of sleeping well than getting up early while your sleep is good, your mood is good. When I started this journey of waking up at 5, I felt too weak, tired, sleepy for a week then after a week everything fell on place and now i don't need any alarm to wake up these days sometimes i'm up even before 5 the first thing i do is brush my teeth and then wash my face i like the coolness of water to wake my body and mind I've completely stopped using any face wash in the morning. This has helped my skin a lot. Cold water tightens the appearance of your skin, so it may make you look renewed and refreshed. It also helps boost your circulation which can help give your skin a healthier appearance. Then I change into my yoga clothes. My skin gets dry, so I use a moisturizer. This will balance and moisturize my skin. Then I drink a glass of warm water. Drinking warm water will improve bowel movement and helps you in giving your metabolism an early kick start. The air quality here is pretty bad so I don't open my windows and switch on my air purifier. I play a soothing music on my TV. That way I do not have to use my phone and AirPods. You can find so many on YouTube. I choose one which is at least 2 hours long. I have few of my favorites which I'll share in my description box. You guys can check it out. And I start with meditation. I try to meditate for at least 10 minutes. Initially, I didn't understand what to do, what meditation actually meant. I could not even do pranayama properly. It only took a few days of doing it to completely convert me. I love the 10 minutes I spend meditating each morning. The peace and clarity it gives me is incomparable. I feel like I have control of my life. I have more patience. I'm calm, less reactive. Then stretching to loosen up the body that still feels stiff. I started with 15 Surya Namaskaras, and now I can do around 25 to 30 without feeling tired, and I absolutely love it. Well, sometimes I skip other asanas and keep only doing Surya Namaskaras. This is my most relaxing time in the day. For me, yoga is a mixture of workout, stretching and meditation, which is a great option to feel your body and breathe. It's a great way to strengthen the entire body. It always wakes you up after a long sleep and increase your energy every morning and I always find myself in peace after every session. I try to not indulge myself in checking social media until I finish my yoga. This keeps me in better mental and physical state of mind throughout the day. After about an hour of yoga, it's time to take Pogo out for a walk. Usually, I start prepping up for breakfast and my husband Stephen, but since he's on a business trip, this duty is on me. And we have no Stephen to make, so we can go for a long walk. It's the best time to go for a walk and see the sunrise.
वंस बैक हो माई फ्रीड पोगो ही लाइक्स फैंसी ब्रेकफेस्ट टू सो वी हैव रोल एंड पनीर फॉर हेम When I'm alone I try to make fancy Pinterest inspired breakfast. I search for recipes that not only fill my tummy but also looks appetizing. So today I'm going to be making Turkish egg and carrot strawberry orange smoothie. It's said you should not eat, drink and shower after yoga for at least an hour. It drains away the energy that was spilled during yoga. So after a good hour of gap I go and take shower. Last year I wanted to read and know Shrimad Bhagavad Gita which I somehow couldn't but 2023 I've started with reading at least 3 pages a day and understanding it I want to improve the quality of my life not materialistically but spiritually and I think this book is an ocean of wisdom that will change the way of living had heard the shloka so many times but never really understood what it meant the meaning of the verse is you have the right to work only but never to its fruits let not the fruits of action be your motive nor let your attachment be to inaction which in simple words means if you want to do a great or a good work do not trouble to think what result you will get how deep isn't it now it's time for breakfast since i've already prepped we just have plating left this recipe turned out really good and it's time to check insta and waste my time watching reels getting up early in the morning gives me sufficient time to enjoy a filling breakfast starting the day with a healthy meal can make you feel full for a longer time so you can carry more energy with you for the entire day even after such heavy breakfast i have my lunch by 12:30 that has become a routine Then we do some sorting, arranging things, watching plans, maybe dusting sometimes, washing dishes before my house help comes home. It's nine o'clock now, and we are done with everything. I can read, write, do anything. I have all the time for myself. This is my morning routine for a productive day without strain. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and hope this video was helpful if you think my channel is worth subscribing then please go ahead like share and leave your comments i will see you soon very very soon in my next video till then take care stay safe bye bye